Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Wright Farms. I just wanted to show the daily chores with the meat chickens. It's not quite much, but I just love how they'll follow the tractor and how I can. This is one thing I really think is cool. I can open the doors and they won't. Uh, only a few will try to go out. It's, oh, it's pretty cool. So I'm going to show you that and you'll get to see how they feed and everything in just the daily. You gotta give them water every morning, you gotta give them food, and then I put them on new grass every day. So, and sometimes twice, but I'm just gonna show you the morning ones. Here we go. So this is the one that doesn't have the feeding trough, but they got food from the other day still because I got a bulk feeder in there. But you can see them just jumping on the new fresh grass. Got one, curious about the door. So now to give them water. Can you do the big one? I see. Can you do that big one? You might need two hands. Let me get your cup. Couple went out. It's okay. Hey guys. Not, not out. Good job, baby. Now let's go get them scratch to eat on, okay? <laughs> Now this is why I like the bellwater systems because I just come in here, fill up the five gallon bucket, and they're good for the whole day. And they'll drink about five gallons, or well close to five gallons because this isn't empty, but it's pretty close to it. So you, ha I have to do it every day and there's 24 in here. So every day just fill it up. Doesn't take too long. Like a minute or so. So I'm going to cut out because you don't want to watch me just fill this up for a minute. Right. Okay, now these ones don't have a bulk feeder. So they definitely seem like they're a little more hungry. They're waiting for us. Now that one thing I like with this feeding trough is I'll show you. We're going to put food in there. And they're going to jump on it. And so when we go to move this coop, they'll follow that uh, gutter feeder. And the cool thing is we hung it up so we don't have to move it. It just does it. All right. Come on, guys, let's feed these guys. Here, May, you gonna feed them? Put it in the in the feeder, okay? Okay, don't dump it all over, bud. Yep, that's good. Watch out, bro. Yeah, that's your seat. So, 
just wanted to share one thing I really love about doing this. One, my kids know where their food comes from. You can barely see them right there. Um, but they also love getting to do these chores with me. They, I, I'm glad I get to teach them to work through this. Even if it takes me a little bit longer working with them or they make a little bit of mess and we spill some food. How we have our system set up, it's not really... You got some feed? Okay, can you feed the chickens? You can dump it out on the ground with that with seeds. Um, but the nice thing with how we have this set up that I like is there isn't really waste. Even if the meat chickens don't eat it, the, as you can see, the egg layers are behind us cleaning up what the meat chickens don't eat. So that's really cool. I just thought I'd share that and I absolutely love getting to get these guys out here and working with me because it's time that, you know, I can't ever make up and I'm grateful that these guys get to know where their food comes from. They, I wouldn't say look forward to processing tape, but they're not afraid of it. And for being only four and two years old, that's pretty awesome because I know at their age I couldn't have done it. Um, up until about a year or two ago, I didn't think I could process my own chickens and then I decided I wanted to and gave it a go. And now I've loved it, but. That's it for the morning chores with the just the meat chickens. This is one of my main things I do every day. Absolutely love it. Like I said, my favorite thing is getting these guys out there with me. So, hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you all have a great day. If you're not, if this is the first time you've seen our stuff, I'll put a playlist to the meat chickens that we've done previous, the all those videos. Um, also, if you're new, Hit that subscribe button. I'll drop one somewhere else on the screen. But, and if you got any questions, shoot them down below. These are Freedom Rangers. We've done Cornish Cross. I love these. They do take a little bit longer. They are a little bit slower. I'm willing to take the time. So, hope y'all have a great day. We will see you guys on the next video.